back to our channel. So today is July 9th and I just got this new shirt from Walmart. It's another one of those, um, I think it's called Real Tree, Real Tree Fishing? Is that what it is? Can't read upside down. Anyhow, um, this is actually a men's shirt, but I really like this color and they didn't have any more women's shirts in my size, so I got this one. It's currently raining, so we're getting ready to head to the lake because it doesn't look like it's raining at the lake. My hot dog came today. I'm super excited about it. And I thought I would bring you guys along with us again. So I hope you really are liking these lake vlogs because I feel like I'm going to be doing them a lot. Just to, like document my memories and um, take you guys along and everything. So it should be fun. But today I'm going to make pinwheels for dinner. So I thought I would share that. Okay, so I thought I would share what we packed for the lake and what we've been doing for like dinners and stuff. So last weekend we went to Walmart and got a hoagie, some salad, and pinwheels for um, the lake. And then I was like, oh my gosh, I can just make those. But last week I didn't have anything prepped. We were out of food. So picking stuff up at Walmart was, was what, what is what is what works best for us. So I'm going to start with some wraps, cheese, and lunch meat, and mayo. Okay, so we're starting with some tortilla wraps to make some pinwheels and now I'm taking my Swiss cheese and just putting it on the bottom there and then I'm adding my lunch meat and so I put my cheese in the middle adding the lunch meat and this was just a variety pack of salami and turkey and ham so I just made um, turkey and ham and then did like salami and ham and turkey on the other one slap some mayo on there and some lettuce and then we rolled up the wrap if anyone has any tips on how to keep these pinwheels together without just using toothpicks please let me know because i use toothpicks but they still felt like they were going to fall apart and when i got them at walmart they didn't even have toothpicks in them and were able to stay closed so i'm not really sure what i'm doing wrong here okay pack the with me, so. I'm gonna put this ice pack at the bottom just to keep everything nice and fresh. Then I made pinwheels, so we're gonna add these. watermelon this is frozen though so i'm not sure if we'll get to eat it or not but it will add just extra cooling to this then i've been making sure i have pasta salad or potato salad or something on hand hand so here's some potato salad from last week I'm going to add in my cheese board tray that I made in this tackle box and there's going to be a, a reel coming out soon about how to make this if you want to know. And then I just got some cookies from Walmart as dessert and I'm going to pack them in the cooler because they have the icing on them so they could melt. And that's everything we pack in our watermelon cooler which is our food cooler. Now we're going to get towels and stuff. And then I believe the cooler's outside, so I don't need that much for drinks. I'm just going to take a strawberry margarita, Seagram's lemon, some wine, house wine, and a Kona, which is my favorite seltzer right now. Okay, now we packed the picnic basket. We got this from Target a couple years ago when my mom got it for us, but I use this for the beach, the lake, everything. So, everything like that. Pack some towels in case we go swimming, which we might. It's a big possibility. Did you pack the hot dog? No. Can you pack the hot dog? Where is it? It's in the garage. Next to the pool. So I just got my hot dog wrapped in, so I've been dying to try it. Towel. Another towel. And um cling pad for Brandy. Okay. And in the other side we'll put in the air pump. Ready's cooling vest. I'm gonna grab a water bowl too to put in here for brandy plates and silverware. 
And I always forget napkins, so I'm gonna fly in some napkins and add that to them. guys so we're just in a cove i was driving the boat um i made a cheese a chicory um tackle box thing um there's gonna be a reel for this i don't know if i already said that or not there's gonna be a reel for this um on my instagram coming soon but um this is a really nice snack because like i'm a little hungry right now but i'm not ready to like fully eat dinner so i'm going to eat some cheese and then put it back because I do believe it's something to warm. 